Hi, and welcome back to the Watchman on the Wall channel. This prophetic word comes from Rachel Miranda Emerson, Bardstown, Kentucky. Prophetic word for America. About six months ago, I had a dream, and in this dream, I was in a child daycare center going from room to room on a tour. I saw many age groups in this place. But what got my attention were these particular words on a banner hanging high over the entry of the building. It said, pray for our military. In the dream, I felt there was a type of deployment or military move that required a number of military to assemble, to move out. I saw families and children. They were without their fathers and mothers. It seemed to be for a lengthy amount of time. Some of the children became fatherless and motherless. I'm sharing this as I feel it's important that we pray fervently for America. I have sounded the alarm many, many times and will continue to do so. As August is approaching, I feel a deep stirring in my spirit. I sense and I, I feel things on the horizon unveiling. As a watchman, I sound the alarm and share what the Lord reveals in dreams, visions, and encounters. Let us diligently pray for the military, pray for the government, pray for our nation and the nations of the world. It has nothing to do with your opinion about people. We must see with our spiritual eyes. We must pray for our leaders of this nation. There are diabolical agendas out there. The alarming exposure is coming. We need to be oiled up, postured, prepared, and ready. Ready in the spirit and in the natural. See Isaiah 62, 6. 1 Timothy 2, 1. Luke 12, 35. And Isaiah 35, 4. Friend, will you pray with me for America? Lord Jesus, we lift up America to you. We thank you, Lord, that you have a purpose and a plan. I thank you, Lord, that you're not done with America yet. Lord Jesus, for everything that this country is going through, being torn apart from within, Lord Jesus, I pray that you would reestablish, reestablish our guidestone as you, Father, the cornerstone, Jesus. Lord Jesus, I pray for anyone in leadership, they would turn from their wicked ways, they would turn to you, Father. Lord, for anyone who's led a corrupt agenda or greed or something even more sinister, Father, that they would turn from that. Lord, send encounters, send dreams and visions. Lord, send laborers into the field. And Lord, that we would see America turned around. Lord, we don't want to forget the nation's the nations of the world. Friend, you may find yourself in a country other than America. I unite my prayer with yours. Lord, that we would see Australia saved, the United Kingdom saved, South Africa, Lord, Iran, China, Brazil, Lord, anywhere where you, Father, are not the Lord and the King we pray, Father, that you have your way. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.